Hi, I'm Natalie with Eminence Organic Skincare, and welcome back to In The Mix. Have you ever woke up one morning and you're like super puffy? and you're wondering, how the heck did I get so puffy? Well, a lot of times we are you know, exposed to different types of toxins, could be the food we ate the night before, too much salt, could be our environmental stressors that see that drying in the skin. So most of us can wake up a little bit full in the mornings. I love to think about how do I depuff myself? How do I get rid of the toxins that could be in my skin? So some ways we wanna do this is that we wanna look at how we can slow everything down in our home care routine so that we can enjoy the experience and depuff and detox the night before or in the morning depending on where you're at. I wanted to share with you a really amazing concept that's in study right now, and it's actually called forest bathing. I'm not too sure if any of you know what that is, but it's really just anchoring down, taking a moment, relaxing a little bit with nature so that you can actually absorb and benefit from your environment. Truthfully, I was just camping this past weekend, so I was right in the forest. So I had lots of forest bathing, and I will have to say, just that experience alone really kind of calmed the mind chilled me out a little bit and got me ready to come and have a chat with all of you today. So how does forest bathing come into your home care routine? And some of the concepts you might hear is this kind of just slowing everything down. And with Eminence, it's super fun to slow things down because your experience with the product really allows you to enjoy it and to relax. So speaking of forests, some of the really cool things you can find in the forest, possibly when you're out there and some of them may be familiar, is that you'll find some mushrooms out there. So we have the gorgeous snow mushroom that you might see and why we like the snow mushroom. Did you actually know that in some cuisine that they'll actually put snow mushrooms in soups and it's about enhancing beauty? And then another mushroom, sure most of you might even know this one is the reishi mushroom and reishi mushroom is used quite a bit in herbal medicine and you'll find it also in foods that we eat in a dried form it is used in chocolate so if any of you are out there and you're seeing a reishi mushroom chocolate go for it they're really um, they contain a lot of compounds like over 400 compounds making it incredibly like a super duper food uh, that will you can have uh, in your dietary all the time. We also have birch trees um, out in the forest and I don't know if any of you are familiar with birch trees but they are gorgeous and they're also known as a tree of life and primarily because they really grow in like where nothing else grows and birch trees actually secrete a beautiful sap and it's also known as birch water so some of you may have consumed birch water or have heard of it in cuisine or in different types of products or environment. But birch water is considered almost like nature's uh, sports drink. It's like hyper in nutrients and really good in antioxidants. And so taking a walk through the forest and in nature, you're gonna find beautiful mushrooms and also the birch trees that give you lots of goodies. Those are just some cool things I wanted to share with you because they're also very important when it comes to skincare and skin health. We want to really replenish water. We want to be able to help uh, flush out anything in our skin that could be contributing to the puffiness in our skin. So looking at um, good nutrients and antioxidants. And we also want to look at making sure that we're having the maximum protection and defense against any of these things that could cause toxins or toxicity in our skin. So what does this all mean? You're like, Natalie, where are we going with this? So, well, I wanted to share with you three brilliant products. And these products can be used in your daily home care routine as well as in your weekly home care routine. It is part of our Pure Forest collection. Uh, beautiful, I can't wait to share them with you, so I'm gonna start right now. One is we have a gorgeous essence. Now, some of you may or may not be familiar with essence. So essence is, it's like a liquid, and it is used right after you do your toner and prior to your serum. And uh, this one is our birch water purifying essence. So you heard me talk about birch water and the birch tree. So we're looking at the birch, and so the sap from this tree. And what we have here is that it is interesting to use. I'm gonna give you a quick little demo so that you can see how we use this. Now remember, so you tone first, so we have our beautiful hydrating mists or our tonings, and just do a quick little spritz. Let that set in the skin for about 30, I like to wait like 30 seconds between my things. So I do like a toner and then I wait 30 seconds and then I'll go with my essence. And how we use this is we actually just do, I just do one, two, and three, three little drops. And you wanna warm it in your hands. So this is pretty cool stuff. And instead of just spraying it out, you're just gonna press it into your skin. 
so I love pressing it through and oh my gosh if you guys can only smell this this is just ridiculous I cannot stop using it so I'm going to press it in and it depends how obsessed you are with this product you can use it up to seven times <laughs> If you're really interested in these things, um, you can check out a few things on K-Beauty and they have a whole kind of ritual around essences, so go for that. Uh, but pressing it in one to two times, if you like, which is kind of what I'm doing at home. So wait the 30 seconds and then you would go with your serum and then continue with your care. Why is this important? That essence are a product that help take the next products and have them work better for you or enhance them. So that's why we love to use your serums post your essence. Uh, then the main place I'm sure all of you are thinking about right now about depuffing and detoxing, okay, is where do we really see puffiness every morning when we wake up? Is our eye area so we can get that ton of, that heaviness and the tiredness in our eyes. And those of you who experience a lot of allergies really are probably honing into what I'm saying now. And any type of relief is welcome. A little trick, I'm sure most of you uh, have a kitchen drawer at home and have spoons inside and I'm sure you've seen this technique a few times but if you haven't I know a few of my friends love to keep their spoons in the fridge because they like it nice and icy and cold but truly metal or, st or steel spoons will already be quite cool so it's not necessary for you to throw them in the fridge if that's something you don't want to do and so what I would do is on a freshly cleansed skin and maybe post the essence application you would take the the, the, the curved side of the spoon and all you need to do is that you want to use them about 30 second holds right so we want to start I always love to start, I'll go, I'll be working in the in, towards the inside to work with a bit of lymphatic drainage. So I just want to press it here. Oh gosh, people, this feels so good. So a little bit here, hold for 30 seconds. And when you're done, then you can slowly move it and come again under here. And then you want to work your way into the inner side of your eye. This really feels amazing. So after I kind of do a deep puffing per se with my spoons, then I want to go in with my eye cream. So we brought in a beautiful, just look at the name, Snow Mushroom Moisture Cloud eye cream. Look how fluffy it is. It's amazing. You don't need a lot of this one. There. I love to always take my eye creams and place on the top of my hand because I love to warm it up. Using your ring finger, remember, because it has the least amount of pressure, so it has the easy way. And then you want to, you can just tap it right in and work in that motion. So after you kind of depuff with the spoon, you can imagine how well this is going to, to settle into the skin. If you're looking at your weekly home care routine as well, you could do like exfoliation, then you could do like your essence if you want to, and then you can go ahead and do a mask. Da, 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 da. So what do you think I'm going to talk about next? Of course, a beautiful mask. So this mask is our snow mushroom and reishi mask, and it's got this beautiful type of fluffy texture to it. And now this is going to really take your skin care and your home care routine to the next level, especially first thing in the morning. Uh, before I move on, there's this wonderful ingredient called paracrest, and it's actually a herbal flowering plant. And uh, paracrest is fantastic for, well, de-puffing, and it's used to help remove and get things moving moving um, out of the system. So knowing that, this is going to be a great mask for you to use. So thinking about in the morning, remember I said if you ever wake up in the morning and you're feeling a bit puffy, this is a fabulous little SOS uh, mask that you can do that will give you immediate relief. So I highly recommend it. It's got a great texture to it, very easy to use. You could use a little bit of water and just gently remove it or splash it off the skin. It's perfect. So looking at how we de-puff and how we get rid of um, the the evidence of toxicity so that could be maybe it's you're even seeing a bit of dryness in the skin you could be seeing redness due to dryness to the skin a bit of that crepiness maybe the skin looks a bit really tired that could be that sign of your environmental stressors that cause it and we want to do a really beautiful home care routine that can do so again you can do these treatments daytime nighttime it doesn't matter masking as I mentioned one of my favorite little tricks is to use the mask first thing in the morning as well because it immediately takes care of any of those concerns and preps my skin for the day everybody can use this all ages all gender no problem and speaking of actually the essence because of the birch water you're also great to use this after you've shaved so all my gentlemen out there anybody who does like post treatment after they do their shaving fantastic again using that splashing method warming it into the palm of your hand and then placing it over the top so I really hope you're digging this new pure forest collection and taking time to forest 
bathe and relax your body because again we know that's also a de-stressor which is not a bad thing and taking advantage of using your products at different times of the day to treat those concerns right away. So there you have it. I'm Natalie with Eminence Organic Skincare for another In The Mix. If you want to see more of our videos, don't forget to hit like and subscribe and to hit that notification bell so you don't miss any more of these fabulous videos. I'll catch you next time. See you later. Thank you.